Welcome. Today we're going to do a kickboxing workout. We are going to incorporate some body weight movements as well. You don't need a lot of space. We're going to start with a two minute warm up. Now, just do some easy leg swings. We want to get the lower body warmed up, the upper body warmed up. Before we start the actual workout, I will show you some of the basic moves. Other side. If you've never done a kickboxing workout before, it is a great stress relieving workout. You don't need equipment. Hip openers. Bring it out, tap, back in. We're really going to be focusing on keeping the core engaged during this workout. Think about why you're here today. Arm circles. The other way. Clasp the hands, stretch to one side, hold it. Middle, other side. Middle. Bring the arm across, stretch through the shoulder. Do a little jog in place. While you're jogging in place, I'm going to show you some of the basic movements that we're going to do today. We're going to start with a jab. So I have my left leg in the front. That means that that arm is going to jab. And you want to turn as you do it. And you can see my foot is pivoting each time. Pivot, pivot, pivot. This is the jab. When we go to the other side, just alternate, then you've got your right. So you're going to punch with your right for the jab. This is where keeping your core tight helps. The next one is a hook. So you can choose, either be forward facing with any of these, or you go to one side because we're going to alternate sides each time. The hook, you're bringing it around bringing it around. You can practice these with me just to get used to them the other side. Hook, hook, hook. Now we'll go to the uppercut. I'll show you forward facing just so you can see that. Uppercut. So you're going underneath like you would hit the jaw or the chin, the bottom of the chin. And you can still see that my leg's moving even though I'm forward facing. Jab, jab. And I'm keeping my guard up. So I'm keeping this other hand up in a fist the whole time. Jab, 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 jab. Other side, jab. Jab, 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 jab. The last one I want to show you is side kicks. So you'll have one leg planted, the other's going to kick out. You may only be able to go this low, maybe a little more, or maybe higher. It's whatever works for you. 
if you need to, you can have a chair or something to hold on to to brace yourself with balance. The other side, you may want to go low. This knee is slightly bent, this leg, or higher. So those are our basic kickboxing moves for today. Make sure you have some water, get a drink of water. We're starting in 15 seconds. We're going to start with the jab. Five seconds. 30 seconds of a jab on the left side. Go. You can go fast. You can go slower to work on the moves. Make sure your core is tight and engaged. Let out the stress. Five seconds, we're switching sides. Switch. Good job. Keep going. We got 10 seconds left on this side. Five. Rest. Give you 15 seconds here to rest. And then next we're going into squats. Feet planted about hip width apart. And you're going to drop down. Ready? Go. 15 squats at my pace. If you need to slow it down, just slow it down. If you don't do all 15 today, it's okay. Seven. Fourteen. 15. Rest. Next we're going to do the hooks. So remember the hook, we have our guard up here. The hook is bringing it around. We'll start in 10 seconds. If you ever need to get a drink of water, get a drink of water. We start in 5 seconds. Hooks on the left, go. Go at your pace. You can see my foot is pivoting as well. You're 15 seconds in. Five seconds, switch to the other side. Switch. Keep going. Keep going. 15 seconds left on this side. Yes, you can. Rest. Next up, we're going to do push-ups. You can either do a full push-up or a modified push-up. You can also do an elevated push-up. So if you have some stable, something stable. I could do a push-up on here if I wanted to. You can do a regular push-up. You can go to your knees, modify, and elbows come out. You can do push-ups this way. Have your wrists under your shoulders, and we'll start in five seconds. So do what works for you. I will modify. Go. 10 push-ups. Eight. Nine. Ten. If you need to, take a little stretch back. Child's pose. 
get a drink of water. We're going to do uppercut next. I like uppercuts. So uppercut, left will be first. You're bringing it up and under. We'll start in 15 seconds. We'll do the left for 30 seconds, the right for 30 seconds. Five seconds, we're going to do uppercut on the left. Ready, go. Uppercut, uppercut. Keep pivoting that foot and core engaged. How do you feel? Check in with yourself. Five seconds on this side, then we switch. Switch. Fifteen seconds. We're going to do 20 rear alternating lunges. So stand. This is one, two. So see how my body is in line, 90 degree angle, bending the back, upright. I'm not slouching or arching too much. I'm in a neutral position. We'll start that. In 10 seconds. Rear alternating lunges. Let's go. One, two. Work within your range of motion. If you can only go down a little, it's okay. Five, six, seven, eight. It's okay to lean forward a little bit. You just don't want to be leaning forward too much like this. I think we're on 14. <laughs> 20. Once you finish your 20, get a drink of water. Important to hydrate before, during, and after workouts. Next, we're going to do the side kicks. So the side kick, you have one leg planted, bent a little bit, you're kicking out. We'll start in 15 seconds. Five seconds. Get that side ready. Go. 30 seconds here. Your balance is always better on one side this is my better side. 10 seconds left on this side, then we switch. Switch. So your planted leg is pointed a bit at an angle. If you want to challenge yourself, you don't have to tap. You can just go down, not touch the floor, or you can tap. Four seconds. Rest. Rest. 
We're going to do a core move that involves punches as well. So you're going to plant your feet and we're going to jab and cross. If you want to challenge, you can go down to a wide squat and punch that way. We start in 10 seconds. Five seconds. Ready? Jab, cross, jab, cross. See how fast you can go. Challenge yourself. If you want to challenge more, go down and do a squat hold. If that's too much, go up and down. Five seconds. Rest. We're going to do one more core move, and then we're going back to the beginning to do part of the workout. Five seconds, and we're going to do knee lifts. Here we go. Knee lifts. Want more of a challenge? Go on your tiptoes, work the calves. Two seconds, rest. Get a drink of water. We're going back to the top. This time, I want you to be forward facing, and we're going to alternate jabs. So it's going to be a jab, cross, jab, cross, jab, cross, and go. We're doing this for one minute this time. If you want to challenge yourself for part of it and go down to a wide squat or a sumo squat, you can do that. You can go down deeper or not as deep. Work on challenging the legs. 30 seconds in, 30 to go. Jab, cross, jab, cross. You can also go down a little bit more. You can go down and up, whatever you choose. 10 seconds, push. Can you go faster? Challenge yourself. Three, two, one, rest. Nice job. We're gonna go back to those squats. We're gonna do 15 squats. If you want a challenge, you can be in the squat position. We'll be up on your toes a little bit, squat down and up, let's go, 15, 1, 2, 3, work within your range of motion, if you can't go down as far, it's okay. It's not about comparison. It's working on your own fitness. I think we're at 13. We'll do one for extra measure. Rest. Get a drink of water. Next, we will do one minute of hooks. We're going to be forward facing again, and we're going to alternate the hooks. I'll give you 15 seconds, then we'll start that. So you'll be hook, hook. See how my feet are turning in? 
We're going to do that. Five seconds. Get ready. Feet about hip width apart or a little more. Go. Hook, 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 hook. Core tight. Engaged. Protect that spine. This is too much. Go back to one side. We're almost halfway through. If you're going back to one side, make sure you switch to the other side. 30 seconds in, 30 to go. You can do this. 20 seconds to go. Can you go a little faster? Five seconds. Rest. Next, we're going to do the 10 push ups. Remember, you can do a regular push up. Or you can do a modified push up on your knees. We'll start in five seconds. Ready? Go. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Go back to child's pose if you need to to stretch. Slowly come on up. Next we have uppercuts. You'll be forward facing. Remember, uppercut underneath the chin. Rotate the lower body as you do that. Five seconds. Ready, go. One minute of alternating uppercuts. Halfway there. You go a little faster. Three, two, one, rest. Next up, alternating rear lunges. We're going to do 20 of them total. You ready? Five seconds. Deep breath in, blow it out through your mouth. Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Halfway through. You've got this. Five more. Rest. Good job. Last thing we have is side kicks. So remember the side kicks. One leg planted, kicking out to the side. Start in 10 seconds. 
We'll do 30 seconds each side for this one. Three seconds. You ready? Go. You can also go a little faster if you want. Or slower. Some days your balance is better, other days not so much. Five seconds and we're switching sides. Switch sides. 25 seconds to go. Fifteen seconds. Guard is up. Five seconds. Three, two, one, rest. Last thing we're going to do, bonus core. Deep breath in. Exhale through the mouth. Another deep breath in, exhale through the mouth, so for this core exercise, feet hip width apart, you're going to go side to side where your hand is about at your knee. If you can't go that far, don't go that far. Ready? Go. We're going to do 20 total. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. 17, 18, 19, 20. See how I wasn't just going like crazy fast with that? It was a little bit slower pace. For this next one, feet hip width apart, opposite elbow to opposite knee. We're going to do 20 total. Deep breath in. Blow it out. Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Halfway through. Next move, toe touch. Opposite hand to opposite leg. Arms are out. Core is engaged. We're going to do 20 total. Shoulders back and down. Let's go. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Halfway through. Seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. I'm so proud of you for doing today's workout. I'm glad that you are here. I hope you feel better. Some stress relief, taking care of your body and mind, and we will see you soon.